In the when you were talking about earlier days, when you kind of moved from print to TV, came back to print, right? In your view, what is the difference in skill set required between, let's say, print, TV, and I would even say now digital, right? If someone is looking towards journalism as a career path, like what what skills do they need to develop separately for each? Or has it become a hybrid because digital has the digital publishing angle that typically has a video component built in with it now? Well, there is a hybrid to a certain extent, of course. You see that in a lot of stories, they'll have, you know, all the elements combined in a way. But um, where... TV is concerned, you have to let the pictures tell the story. I mean, if you want to be a good TV journalist and not just a celebrity, you got to let, and especially if you're doing investigative reporting, you got to let the pictures tell the story. And uh, in print, it's uh, you can go into more more detail in a way. You can, uh, and, and also I find, I find TV journalism very frustrating. Why? Because what I found is, you know, people with sources or interviewees, but you know, they'll tell you a whole lot of very provocative, interesting uh, stuff. And the minute the camera comes out, they freeze. So uh, you you don't get that. You're like, yeah, but you were just saying, <laughs> and they just don't want to, uh, you know, articulate the same thing on camera. Uh, but in print, I find it actually easier to go in and just talk to people and get whatever material I need to get. Do you think that print is still the truest form of journalism? In many ways, yeah, I think so. And there's a certain permanence to print. And there's also a, a kind of feeling that, you know, in print, if you if you make a mistake, you, you, you clarify, you at least I'm talking about the way TV journalism is practiced here. They, they make just such horrendous, egregious errors. And nobody apologizes. They just go on. They're like, it's, it's like that's fine. You know? Like in print, right. if you're a conscientious publication, you will... Uh, you know, make a, correct, a, reaction, a retraction or a clarification. Yeah. Or, so I think there is a certain level of trust uh, that, you know, that print intrinsically, print journalism intrinsically has. And it's it's also because it's sitting in your house in your hands. I mean, no one can change it or scrub it, right? So the permanence there is, you know, with TV, I can flood the screen for the next 48 hours with something completely different and drown out what I'd said. Here it's there. And it's and there's nothing you can do about it. So you're saying a print journalist now has more ways to express their story because of the digital support that they get. Interesting. 